Well, well, well. Good afternoon again, everybody. It's like 12.30 in the afternoon. Steven Sir Stops a lot, just dropped me off. We went and had breakfast this morning. Of course, I slept in till like eight. And then we went to bed breakfast. Then we went to Walmart. And then it's a 45 minute drive here, so. Yeah, it's 12.30. But I'm only doing 11.8, I think it is, to Route 9, the road that takes you into Bennington. I'm going back to the Catamount. I'm eating so good in Bennington. Thank you so much, Steve Lombard. Yeah, appreciate it for sure. And what else? We got a couple cool things coming up today. Got this first little climb, and then we're gonna walk this ridge, drop down into Bennington. But looks like it's gonna be a beautiful, beautiful day as well. So, yay! I'm happy about that. And I hope you guys have a great, great day. And I'll touch back with the cool stuff and the views, you know, just like I do, baby. So let's go enjoy this day. <laughs> How beautiful! Ooh, I like this area. There's a dam right here. It's magical. I'll show you. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Dam. <laughs> Vermont doesn't look like it's going to be very muddy this year, which is good. Usually this part of the ridge is really muddy. It's been so dry lately, though. It's actually pleasant up here. <laughs> actually, this ridge right here is usually the muddiest, slipperiest part of Vermont. And right now, I mean, there's some... You could tell they were muddy like a couple weeks ago, but it's really soft, dry mud now. Makes it a lot better when you're not slipping and sliding everywhere. <laughs> and sinking in mud. It's nice. Way different than last year. What place? So the Green Mountains have a whole different feel to it. It just seems like there's more vegetation. That's probably why it's called the Green Mountains. Super cool in here though. And Vermont's a little different as like 
you walk in the woods and pop out to a view spot. It's not just like random views all day long. You're in the woods most of the day. And then you do pop out. It's usually a fire tower or a high point. It's beautiful. Boom, out to another cool pond. Awesome. Yeah, this area is pretty cool. Let me get us up here a little more and I'll spin you again. Look out here. Like early morning, I could just see this being moose territory. Here we go. Now we've got a better view at it. Booyah, baby. Pines in the middle of nowhere. I love it. where we came from everybody now we're walking next to this nice little stream it's really peaceful The thing is low. Usually it's flowing way better than that. But, you know, you either take a bunch of water in here or a muddy trail. Or, I mean, if you have a bunch of water, it's going to be a muddy trail. If it's dry, you have much water. You know what I'm trying to say? Harmon Hill. Let me walk you over here. This is like a side trail. Oh, what a great tent site. <laughs> Holy cow. Here, let me zoom in. Mm, boop. That town down there is the town of Bennington. You know, where I've been staying for like a week. <laughs> Pretty nice. It's a little hazy. But it is beautiful. Bennington, baby. So now what we're gonna do, we're on top of Harmon Hill. We've got this, everybody complains about the downhill onto, into Route 9, uh, the road takes you to Bennington. I love it. So 
it's like straight down the last little bit. It's like a staircase almost, but the staircase isn't quite as good as it was back in the day. But I love that downhill. All right, guys, top of Harmon Hill. Let's get going. We're going to drop down to the road, baby. This away. All right, now we're gonna be dropping super fast. <laughs> In 2020, I was hiking with Katie and PR. PR just kept pulling and pulling and pulling, so I told Katie, let me have him. <laughs> and we ran all the way down this thing. PR loves downhills too, so I had a hard time keeping up with him on this downhill, but we were cruising. Almost growing so fast that I was kind of nervous. And that takes a lot for me to get nervous. Yeah, we we're cruising. Kind of like what I'm going to do right now. Well, I'm not attached to a dog. Nice. <laughs> That's what we came down. And it's not very often you sweat on a downhill. It is when you're moving that one. You gotta focus like every step. Yeah, makes you sweat. Takes a pretty gnarly downhill to make me sweat on the downhills. I can hear the road, so we're close. Well, well, well. Thought I just scratched my phone. The camera. <laughs> Doesn't look like I did, but we'll find out. It's really boogered my case right up. Crap. I just tried to clean off that piece of dirt on my lens. <laughs> not a piece of dirt I just scratched my camera lens man I hope that doesn't affect my videos it's in the it's not like in the pupil of the lens it's off to the side I don't know if it's gonna cause issues when the Sun hits it or darn it Well, at least I've had a good run with this phone. <laughs> Crazy! Never scratched my camera before. I don't know how they fix that. I know it's impossible to deal with on trail. You almost got to get a new phone. And there's nowhere to do that. I'll do some investigating later. To see if it did anything to my picture quality. If it did, I guess I could try to find an Apple store. <laughs> oh, Mom always said I couldn't have nothing nice. <laughs> Route 9. So I'm going to end my day. So tomorrow when I start my video, you'll see this bridge right here. The William D. MacArthur Bridge. It looks like there's a party in this parking lot, so let's go see what's going on. America, baby.
parking lot party. <laughs> it's awesome. And this is super cool. Look, he's even got my logo, man. Spot on. What's happening, everybody? End of the day recap, day 46. We left County Road at 1603.9. We're now sitting at Route 9 at 1615.1. Makes it an 11.2 mile day, everybody, which today was actually pretty nice. Uh, and it was pretty sweet rolling out into Route 9. And like the whole parking lot was like a party. So <laughs> when I rolled down, I saw Heath Doty sitting there. Steve Lombard, Sir Stops a lot, and then Steve-O was there, then Leaf pulled up. It was awesome. It was like five people down there, and they all got to meet each other, which is even better because great people meeting great people is always cool. Um, and Leaf pulled up with like this orange cream milk. I didn't think I'd like it, but it was pretty good. Then he gave me a chocolate milk. Steve-O had coffee drinks. <laughs> he Doty gave me some chocolate milk. I mean, I... Man, you guys are taking care of me out here. Check this out. This is awesome, too. Oh, hey, what's up? So, Steve-O, like, opened up this tote. And I don't even have to get resupply now. Got me these. These are nice. These cook super fast. They're, like, really thin noodles. And they're good. Got some Oreos, fruit snacks. These things are the whip. If when you can get coffee with creamer and sugar already added in it, awesome. Uh... Andrew Veleza actually gave me some. It wasn't this Trader Joe's stuff, but this is good too. Mountain House Meals, Cheez Its, Noon Tabs. I'm going to try a couple of these. Last time I tried them, I didn't really like them, but I figured I'll give it another whirl. Pringles, Propel, Beef Sticks. <laughs> Thank you, Steve O. I don't even have to resupply now. Pretty awesome. Um, and it looks like tomorrow. Uh, what I'm going to do. Oh, and Stephen Bombard and Sir Stop Slot. Thanks for everything you guys have done for me. Like, yeah, the endless shuttles and like just hanging out all the time. It's pretty sweet. So, yeah. Uh, but tomorrow my plan is to go Route 9 to County Road 20.6 miles. So I'm going to do a 20. Um, but I'm going to leave before noon. So I should be able to pull it off. I want to try to be a trail like 8 a.m. at least. So I can be done by five, hopefully. I don't know. We'll see. <clears throat> I got like, it's not a 10 mile steady climb, but it's a 10 miles until you get to Glastonbury Fire Tower, which is supposed to be beautiful out tomorrow. So hopefully we get them views. And uh, yeah, that's the dealio. Day 46, 11.2 miles. I hope you guys had a great, great day. And I'll touch back with you guys in the morning, baby.